everyone, how's it going? This is the Bald Metal Nerd coming at you with um, just a quick take on this subject because it's a little after 1 a.m. Monday night slash Tuesday morning, however you want to look at it. I'm not sure when I'm going to upload this, but uh, I've been doing some thinking about um, the recent events uh, surrounding the death of George Floyd as well as the... Um, you know, demonstrations slash riots that have been going on nationwide. Um, as you guys know, I occasionally talk about politics on this channel. Um, and this has been an absolute dumpster fire of a year. Uh, 2020 has been the worst year that I can think of in a while. You know, obviously the coronavirus is the main thing uh, that everyone's been focused on all year uh, up to this point. But um, this, the incident that occurred with George Floyd, the, the murder by police of George Floyd, um, seemed to basically throw a match onto the gasoline fire of our society, right? Um, you know, there has been problems with uh, you know, the way police have treated minorities for, you know, really since the beginning, I guess. Um, and this incident really throws that into a national light more than other incidents have. Um, this is the first time in a long time I can really remember nationwide demonstrations slash riots about, uh, you know, something like this. So, I've been watching the news and seeing the footage just like everyone else has. And uh, my thoughts on it are going to be fairly simplistic. Um, you know, I don't condone the rioting, you know, um, and there have actually been people killed uh, during some of these demonstrations. So I don't condone all of the actions being taken, of course. Um, that being said, I don't think property damage is more important than a man's life, right? Uh, but again, some of the times they are going uh, the wrong direction in, you know, people getting shot in the protests and stuff. So it's, it's not just all peaceful. Um, as far as the, quote, uh, racial component of it, I've seen people of multiple races acting very badly during these protests in the footage. So it's definitely not one group or another that's doing it. Uh, plus, I've seen lots and lots of videos of police kind of escalating the situation, basically uh, going into peaceful protests and, and doing some very inappropriate things, very improportionate responses. So uh, there's a lot of stupidity to go around, and um, it saddens me to see this. Um, I'm hoping that we can move forward somehow as a society. Um, I don't know. Um, tomorrow, I'm going to be going and voting for Bernie for the last time in the Indiana primary. Uh, well, I guess by the time you see it, I'll probably have already done it. Um, it's depressing to know that uh, that's going to be the last time I, you know probably ever vote for him um, because I felt he really was the figure that had the best chance of transforming this country for the better uh, and just knowing that that dream is pretty much dead at this point, at least for the foreseeable future, is depressing. Um, I don't know. I really don't know. Um, all I know is that the people are hurting right now. You know, um, and even to those who are doing the bad things, for lack of a better term, sometimes people get to the point where they start to really rebel in an extremely negative way like what we're seeing. I mean, we could have had a peaceful political revolution. Um, instead, what we're getting is uh, a lot of peaceful protests, but also some violent outrage which, given the circumstances, is not shocking. Again, I don't condone it, but I most certainly do understand it. 
Um, you know, so uh, it's kind of my unformed random thoughts on this. Uh, we need major change, and um, I hope something good happens at some point in this country because uh, we could certainly use it. So anyway, that's pretty much it. I just wanted to say something about this. Um, of course, I wish things were different, but they are what they are, and I hope that uh, we pull our collective heads out of our asses <clears throat> and actually move forward in a positive way. But uh, humanity always finds a way to disappoint me. So <laughs> that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, I'll catch you guys next time.